We be fucking when she come in town And I fuck with the shorty cause she gon' hold it down They was hating back then, I bet they hating now Fucking when she come in town And I fuck with the shorty Hey okay guys, welcome back to my channel So it's A.B. Lachey This is Cooking With Me, episode 2 So we are making seafood rice today And here we go What you want to do is Cut your peppers, onions Whatever you want to add in your rice But I just use red, green, and yellow peppers So you're going to cut those up And then you're going to cut your crab meat up Really nice Um, Now we have the shrimp the crab meat, yellow pepper, red pepper, green pepper. We have all of our seasonings. You see that Tony's, that's my favorite. Make sure you have bay leaves because that plays a big part in the uh, seafood rice. So these are all the ingredients that we're gonna be using today. So now you're gonna add water into a pot and then add uh, your complete seasoning, your bay leaves, um, your Tony's and usually I use Badea to make the rice yellow but since I don't have any I just went ahead and used Sazon but um you're free to use the Badea if you can find it I couldn't find any during the pandemic so I just went ahead and used the Sazon so as you guys can see I'm just seasoning my rice um to give it some flavor um so it can have, you know, a little flavor right before I add um, the rest of the ingredients. So I'm going to go ahead and add the whole pack of Zazon. Later, I went ahead and added another pack of Zazon because I didn't like that it wasn't yellow enough. So the Badea does the job though. The Badea is the best. Um, make sure you add some Old Bay in there to give it that seafood seasoning taste. And then what you're going to do, you're just going to stir those um, ingredients around in the pot just like you see me doing so just go ahead and stir that up so next we're going to go ahead and clean our rice because rice is very dirty um so just have a pot or a bowl whatever you decide to use to go ahead and put the rice in there and water and go ahead and clean it around for like i say like a minute or two just to get everything out and make sure that it's clean enough um so go ahead and just you know swerve it around a little bit just to get that dirt off of the rice just add it in there And just give it a stir so it won't be all clumped together. That's how your water should look once it's seasoned and you have oil. And now it's just boiling. So the rice is cooking at this point. Next, you're going to add butter to a pan, like a separate pan, because you're going to have to um, add your seafood and your onions in this pan. So you're going to add a separate pan or get a separate pan, I'm sorry, and add butter to it. And then you can go ahead and, um, you know, saute the butter around the pan just so it could get everywhere. Then you're going to add your complete seasoning your garlic powder, your Tony seasoning, your Old Bay, paprika and Old Bay. I use paprika or cayenne to give it a little spice.
then you're gonna go ahead and add your shrimp in there these are raw shrimp i do not cook with cooked shrimp because it's just disgusting it tastes like rubber so these are raw shrimp that you can go ahead and add in there and then you add your crab meat make sure you get all of that out of there Then you add your green pepper. Your yellow pepper. And your red pepper. Then you're gonna go ahead and once you add that, you're gonna season your seafood as well. So make sure that you're seasoning the rice as well as your seafood. So you're just gonna go ahead and stir that around a little bit. And try breaking up your crab meat, because as I said before, you could cut it, but if you don't cut it fine enough, then you'll still have some chunks in there. So make sure you cut that um, the best you can. Now you're going to add your complete seasoning. I don't really know how many teaspoons or tablespoons I use. Just do like a handful the first time and then go light the second time. So heavy handed then light. That's how I cook. Heavy handed then light with the seasoning. And that's the garlic powder. And then the Tony's, of course. And then that's your Old Bay. And then you're going to just go ahead and stir it around a little bit. Chop, chop, chop. And you can add more butter um, to this pan. I decided, actually I did add butter later on. So now what you're gonna do is go ahead and flip the rice into a pan of your choice. The cooked rice. And then you add your seafood and your, pep your peppers. And then once that's done and you have, you know, the seafood on top of the rice, then you're going to go ahead and season the entire pan. So you could go heavy twice. So back and forth, back and forth, go heavy twice. And we're just using the same old seasons that we used earlier. It's nothing, you know, different. Then you're gonna mix it, mix it all together. And voila, you're done.
make sure you guys like comment and subscribe turn on your post notifications um thank you thank you thank you so much to my 1000 subscribers 